Hey, step inside that booth, I'm loose in the top, 503 line is alive. Shouts out to the almighty LDBC, man. Usual suspects, man, high take video. Okay, so word around the curb is Al Heyman and Showtime have not renewed the contract for the 2024 year. Um, and it's rumored that Showtime Boxing is quote unquote coming to an end. Steven Espinosa nor PBC have officially came out with a statement and verified this information. This is all sources say, aka gossip, aka rumors. You know what I'm saying? And I just want to go ahead and say this, bro. Y'all have been praying on the PBC's downfall for quite some time. Now, like I say, I don't I don't always agree with uh PBC. You know what I'm saying? I don't like some of the things that go on on PBC, but I do like some of the things that go on with the PBC. But people have been pushing a narrative for quite some time trying to destroy Al Heyman and all of his fighters at the PBC. Uh, you know, they've been saying for years that the PBC was going to go broke. Um, the PBC was going to have to go back to ESPN, uh, have to go back to Golden Boy. Um, all these things they have been trying to destroy Al Hammond for years. You know, he's been sued by Bob Aram and um De La Hoya for co collusion and colluding and all type of crazy stuff. Um, now it's pros and cons to um being a fight fan for the PBC because for me, I like the fact that Al Hammond does encourage fighters to take control of their own careers um he is getting fighters paid more money um he is uh making fighters start their own brand their own company with uh their promotion so they can also get a fighter's check and a promoter's check and i'm all for uh you know athlete empowerment and stuff like that um so al Heyman does some good things for the fighters you know what I'm saying? If you're pro-athlete, you know what I'm saying? You definitely got to like that side of the business for the fighters. It don't benefit me none. But, I, you know, I don't want to see these dudes um, getting beat up and punched in the head. And, you know, they don't have nothing, um, you know, in their bank account to pay their bills or go to the doctor or whatever they need to do. Um, so I, I'm, I'm, for, I'm for Al Heyman and the PBC with that. The only thing I honestly don't like about the PBC is... Um, is the inactivity. Um, you know what I'm saying? You know, mo most fighters over there, they only fight once a year. Um, very, very inactive. I know that it's very, very hard for the PBC because they have so many fighters and you only have so many dates. Right? And now, um, you're pushing, you know, everything on Showtime. Um, rumor has it that he might be going to Amazon Prime, which is not a bad thing. Um, depending on how you look at it. Now, I I I hear some guys saying, um, you know that they don't want another network or platform brought into the situation. But one thing about Al, man, Al is always three steps ahead of the game. Um, he he will go out and find the bag. He is the ultimate hustler, and it, it really don't make sense to me as to why Showtime Boxing would end when Showtime Boxing has had one of the best years in boxing. It don't make sense. Now they might be moving it moving the uh showtime boxing to paramount plus now if you do have paramount plus on your smart tvs or on your phone you can watch showtime boxing on paramount plus you know what i'm saying if you have this if you have the paramount plus and you have the showtime on the paramount plus you can watch it you know what i'm saying so it might be going over there you know what i'm saying but man like 
we gotta like people gotta stop hating on this dude, bro. Like at this point, it's just pure hatred um, and racism for a black man that's in power. You know what I'm saying? If, and if you keeping it boxing, then you just want to see, you know, the, the, the best fights. I understand that. Because I would love to see Al Heyman on, take take uh, the PBC to the zone or to ESPN and, you know, him and Bob Aram, Eddie Hearn do business. All of them do business together. You know what I'm saying? Um, I would love to see that. But Al Heyman... Um, he don't, let's just be honest, bro. He don't want to share the money with them. You know what I'm saying? He don't want to share the money with them. Because it, because you got to understand. If Al Heyman takes all of his fighters to that network, you know what I'm saying? It's only going to be so much money that can go around. And the way that Al Heyman pays um, the fighters that he manages, man, these dudes get a different type of bag. And then it's gonna fuck up the infrastructure with top rank because they because guys are only getting a fighter's check. It's gonna fuck up the in infrastructure at Golden Boy because guys are only getting a fighter's check. It's gonna fuck up the infrastructure at uh the zone with Eddie Hearn and Metro because these, you know some of these dudes only get fighters checks, man. If you're not Devin Haney or if you're not AJ, um if you're not Canelo, you know what I'm saying? And these fighters talk. You know what I'm saying? They talk. They compare and contrast, you know what I'm saying? They pulling up, they checks and you know what I'm saying? It, it, with, with, with the way technology is right now, man, you know, you can p get on your phone and pull up all of your bank statements, your, your uh, checks and everything. So, do you really want these guys all on the same motherfucking network? Because if you, if you think that they arguing about money now, how you think it'll be when they all on the same network? You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, hey, it's pros and cons to it. You know what I'm saying? I know everybody want to, you know, be kumbaya and be happy about uh, Al Heyman possibly and going to another network um, and Showtime being over with. But this is the thing, man. I could have sworn I, I heard Espinosa say the other day that he... Is already in talks with Tank coming back next year for 2024. So y'all got to make it make sense. The math ain't mathing with this shit. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I guess these guys, they want Bob, Aaron, and Eddie Hearn to get some of that PBC clout, man. And maybe they'll start, maybe they'll start putting on some, um, some big fights. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but let me know what y'all think about it, man. PBC over with. Is it the end of PBC? Showtime boxing. And and if you rooting for this shit, bro. If you really rooting for Showtime boxing to end, bro. Are you really a boxing fan or are you just a, a hater? <laughs> make it make sense, y'all. I'm up out of here, man. Deuces.